one in all the Ampel of games. And welcome to Hearthstone Next Attack. I wanted to give it a different name because uh, Hearthstone Half Hour don't really fit the format of what I want to do. I want to just take them one by one and go through it. That's uh, a better way of doing it. I'm doing it in a weird order in the fact that I sort of skip the Arachnid Court. I'm starting another play. But I will go back and do the Arachnid Court to people who need help on that. We're going to start with Noth the uh, Plague Bringer. Uh, and we are going to see how we do now. His, uh, his ability is a passive one. That's just the first time we've seen a passive ability in the game. Uh, and it's an interesting one, which is whenever an enemy hero dies, raise a 1 1 minion. Now, I was thinking, how do I best want to uh, try to do this? And I'm going to go with a. Uh, I've got choices whether I could rush. Uh, I don't think controls right here. Uh, rush was definitely something that came to mind. I could be scumbaggy and use Ice Mage. Uh, I don't know. Uh, we'll start with Rush because I always find that Rush is always helpful. Even though I don't think it's uh, appropriate based on what I'm facing. But we'll see. Maybe I can out Rush him. I'm not even sure what my Rush deck looks like at the moment. So this will be interesting. It's been a while since I've played Rush. I played it slightly last week, just to uh, check out how uh, Zoo's been playing with uh, Gul'dan versus North the uh, improvements bringer. from the first wing, as you would uh, with the uh, Nerubian egg. Another one, soul no, for the collection. You know, like Your soul hand. shall be mine. I take out the harvest in case I get something quicker, like a uh, void walker. I don't. I can start with Flame Imp, I think. That makes sense. Mm, yeah. I'll start with Flame Imp and see how it goes from there. Obviously, I don't know what he's going to be playing, so it's going to be quite interesting to see uh, what's the best thing to do against him. Once again, he's doing nothing, so I'm going to rush it into my free two. Now, board wipe could be a problem here. Oh, I really couldn't care less about that card, to be honest. As blase as it may sound. Do you need a blessing? The light protects me. That went really well. Get in there and fight, maggot! So we can really bad here. Yeah? Basically, almost guarantee the game really early on. Uh, I'll show you the deck afterwards for those interested. I think we're basically in a good position early on. He just doesn't seem to be able to keep up. More to form up the but... I mean, it does give me the advantage of uh, finally getting to activate my ability. Uh, can we do it this turn? That's four, that's eight, eleven. 13, 14, 16. Uh, not yet. Close, though. I think the best thing to do here is control based on the fact that we don't know what that last bot was doing. Okay. guys could uh, basically say that maybe that was bad of me to play in that way. That's quite an interesting card actually, looking at that, Skeletal Smith. So I've got quite a bit of damage already available to me. Do I just keep hitting him? I fight. I think I'll maintain my score. And that should be put us in a position where we're ready to finish off. You could uh, say that I've misplayed in how I've played the game so far, but I think the control is really important because now we're basically won. Might as well see if we can do some razzle dazzle. 
There's a doom god to uh, ensure that we would have had very much some fun. That was a really easy game. We are back with the deck list. So uh, time to rush into the deck I'm using at the moment for that game. To beat off the uh, Plaguebringer, I used two soul fires, two power overwhelming. Oh, I'll just sort of go through it by uh, just showing you. Because uh, it's really quick and simple. It re if I uh, went through my choices, it's pretty self explanatory. It's all early rush game, and you kind of drop off at five at most. Uh, I think the only thing you can do to improve the deck at the minute, I'm. Uh, using the one young priestess and one defender uh, you might prefer to use one or the other I've just uh, I like to keep one and one I find that uh, both have uses some people don't like young priestess and uh, some don't like sort of a high fours because it kind of uh, makes for a uh, sort of less uh, rush potential in terms of overwhelming the field but that's what I've gone with uh, hope that's helped you and uh, stay tuned for more Naxa Tech. <laughs> 